Welcome to the University of Michigan Dentistry Podcast Series, promoting oral health care worldwide. The circumferential clasp gains its retention from engagement of the undercut area, gingival, to the buccal bulge of a posterior tooth. The wire contacts the tooth just occlusal to the free gingival margin, and it continues, extends into the palatal acrylic to be about one millimeter off the tissue. Circumferential clasps are usually constructed from 0 .0 30 stainless steel wire, although they sometimes are constructed of heavier wire, depending on the need of the particular case. The first step is to bend a small curve in the end of a short section of wire. You try the wire back on the model the wire should adapt just above the free gingival margin. A mark is made at the point where the wire should extend into the palatal area. A small bend is made, a series of small bends, to sweep the wire into the palatal extension. You have to try it back on the model several times during this procedure to be sure that each bend you've made is correct. The wire should be adapted to be about a millimeter off the palatal tissues. A small loop for retention in acrylic is bent into the end of the palatal extension of the clasp wire. The completed circumferential clasp engages the buccal undercut area of the tooth firmly and it's adapted to run just occlusal to the free gingival margin of the tooth. The palatal extension is adapted to be approximately a millimeter off the tissues, so it can be completely embedded in acrylic. You've been listening to a presentation from the University of Michigan School of Dentistry, which is dedicated to supporting open learning and open educational resources. This recording is licensed under the Creative Commons. It may be reused and redistributed for nonprofit use. Please attribute materials to the University of Michigan School of Dentistry and redistribute under this same license. For more information on how this and other University of Michigan School of Dentistry recordings may be used, visit www.dent.umich.edu slash license.